Hey, get back here. You almost feel bad for me at this point, right? Mont Leaks was able to find the launch legends that are coming out. Um, it's weird because they could have easily prevented this from happening by having the stream on Friday, right? They just got launched today. Maybe, I don't know if they're waiting for the images to be available before they did the stream, but man, this 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 sucks. But we'll still be streaming and see what else they can reveal. I don't know if they do like more solo stuff, but we kind of already know a lot of that structure. What else they have to reveal for tonight? Uh, but one thing I will say is uh, Tori Holt, the level master that I that I confirmed in, or that I showed in the last video, has been confirmed for next year. Now I don't know what this little thing is. Looks like an X Factor um, type of uh, thing. So maybe there's a new X Factor. We don't know. We haven't seen. Um, it starts at 92. Looks like the level master. We know the level's going to 50. Last year Ricky Williams was a 92. So the le the overalls are going down. Good or bad, it is what it is. Uh, we kind of thought a little bit of this, you know, with, with chemistries being powerful, um, they might lower the overalls or lower the chemistries. So, so we're seeing a little bit of the lowering of the overalls. This is like one of the cards we've seen. As I showed in my last video, we saw other ones like Aaron Rodgers, like 83. But, you know, in regular rosters, he was also nerfed from where he was last year too. So there's still a little bit to go there, uh, but it does look like they have lowered the overalls to start the year. Catching traffic at 80, that's tough. Don't throw in coverage. 90 speed is not bad though. So... I don't know. You got basically nine points of speed from day one until the end of the game to improve upon in cards. Is that low enough? Uh, who's to know? But it doesn't seem like a very wide range to me. Uh, so maybe they'll go over 100. That'd be kind of cool. Anyways, so Tory Holt, the level master. Those are his stats. Exciting. Let's go through the legends who we have. Elway is up first with his crazy eyes. Don't get in the way of Elway. He will helicopter you. So... Solid arm, rocketed arm. What do we think the legend's gonna be at launch? 88, 89, maybe if the level master's 90. But I could totally see him being a 90. At least one of these being a 90. We got Marcus Allen there, number 32 in the Raiders. Um, a card that we have had. Solid. A lot of these things are returning. Harrison, Marvin. Um, a, a, a very similar to. I, I don't know about very similar. He'll probably have pretty high catch in traffic, actually. He was a very good. Uh, you know, receiver. Didn't he have the. Did he set the single season record for receptions one year? Or am I mistaken? Um, yeah, I think it's been surpassed, but I, I, I don't want to say that I'm accurate there because I don't know. Uh, Larry Allen here, 73, um, holding it down. Of course, these legends are going to be a little bit low overall. They won't be surpa uh, surpassed. So I, I myself am a fan of Mel Blunt getting a legend card right away. Um, I had a question from a freak amazing if I'm disappointed him he came so early. One, I expect him to get three cards this year then, right? If you're a launch legend, you'll probably get one maybe around December-ish. And then you, when they start recycling guys more, because we got recycles like in October or, or so last year, it was kind of disappointing. Um, and then probably again for Ultimate Legend. So an early on Legend, in my opinion, is a good thing. Um, even though it might get beat out by the middle of the football season, we'll probably get one dropped around Christmas. At least that's my guess. We saw what happened with like Vic last year around the same thing. Um, l early Legend then then uh, launched around his, his December card was bonkers and his Ultimate Legend was even uh, more so. But the December card was really like the tilting of the scale to Mike Vick being overpowered. So Blunt, I'm happy with it. Um, I saw some comments about like, are we with the, with the higher arc on the passes, will height matter more? I don't know. We'll see how interactions play with animations and stuff and how zones get close. But right now, man, the, the cloud flats and the ability to get over top of them with corners and how badly zones played, I guess you need as much length as possible. So cool. Steelers theme team needs DBs as the Steelers have struggled with that uh, lately. Strahan here. We have all used Strahan quite a bit in the last couple years. Nothing new. Derek Brooks too. Not exactly exciting, but they got multi-year contracts. Ken Houston back. I think we saw him in Madden 18. He was nice. I think it was the first card with Unfakeable, if I don't, re if I remember correctly, or one of the first uh, with Unfakeable, and it was so needed back then when Barry Sanders was slipping everybody out of their shoes with the spin and stuff. Uh, they brought, they made a new ability in order to try and to stop it. Then they just realized, all right, we just have to straight up nerf it. We can't solve it with ability. So Houston, um, solid card, tall again. I think he's also six three. Not a hard hitter, but a, a play the ball type of DB. So we're uh, we got some decent decent cards on launch, some some good names. I mean, they're big names. It's just names that we've had before in game. Um, I think they will be top end players in the in the uh, game. But ultimate trainers went over that in last video. He also tweeted out this little like uh, card art that was kind of uh, interesting. The ultimate trainers. You got more of it with the star. Somebody in the comment section for last one said this was a satanic star. So I'm just gonna go ahead. Yeah, hell yeah, Satan stars. So yeah, we'll see what this. Uh, King's logo is 
type of thing. I don't know. I don't know what a team diamond type of thing. I think is what we were speculating on. Uh, ultimate trainers to 85 overall master. I don't know what it means, but I'm excited. All right, should be kind of cool. I I I I mean, this for me. I know leaks are not how EA wants to broadcast it out to the world, and the EA dick suckers are like, oh, leaks are bad. I love it. I it's just getting me more hyped, right? I'm excited. I especially love all the people that are just giving shit to EA. That like when they when they tweeted this out, like the amount of people that are like too late. You got beat to your own content. I had I had a good little chuckle because we don't need y'all no more. <laughs> uh yeah. So like okay maybe late yawn. Everything is out low. Yeah. So I was giving EA crap, which is to be deserved because yeah they they completely bundled bungled another release. But uh, that's it. Let me know what you guys think of the legends. Maybe I'm being too uh, jaded and anti EA, and I should I should perk up, be a happier person because that leads for a happier life. But in the end, it doesn't really matter. Tory Holt should be a fun card to go with. I like the position of depth at level master. But thanks for watching. Call to action. I'll see you later.